Hello and welcome to another video. Uh, my name is Praveen Balan and the tool that I'm going to speak today is about a transcoder or a video transcoder that can help you reduce the size of the video from any format. So I'm going to play a video which I recorded in 4K. Today in this video we're going to focus on a very important feature of Microsoft Teams. It is all about recording the meetings. Uh, the video looks nice but look at the size and the size is really really big and the time of the video is just under 10 minutes but the size of the video is 500 MB which is definitely not good. So we can use handbrake the transcoder that I spoke about to reduce the size of the video. There are two options you can either keep the same resolution or you can even modify the resolution to a full HD from the 4K. So let's download the handbrake tool and the beauty about this tool is like it is available in three operating system in a Windows machine and in a Linux machine and also it can work on a Mac machine. So I'm using it currently on a Windows machine so let's download and complete the installation. The installation was quick so let's open the tool let's drag and drop the file that we just played a while ago and we will target to reduce the size of the file and also convert from 4k to full HD it's not mandatory that you must convert it to lower resolution in order to reduce the size of the file the handbrake can reduce the file size without even compromising the resolution of the video. So I have chosen to reduce the resolution so that I can show that as option as well to you while I am showcasing you how can it work. So there are many presets available. By default it will choose the full HD preset and I am going with default so that it makes it easy for you to understand how easy to use this tool. So which means if you are not a very good expert on video editing still you can make use of this tool because there are many presets available. And if you are considerably good at video editing you can modify some of the settings available in the tool. So I am going with the presets of fast full HD option so let's see how good or how good it is getting compressed so before we go into multiple options this process can take some time I'm just fast forwarding it to avoid delays and as I have already mentioned this software is available in Windows Mac and Linux operating system and also this is an open source and it is a free software you don't need to pay anything to use the software and with the level of presets available anybody virtually anybody can use it you don't need any technical knowledge on video editing the encoding is almost finishing and uh, once it finished it's finished already so let's see the size of the video now you might have noticed Q finished with one error that's because I cancelled the previous encoding operation. It has nothing to do with the last one that, just, that we just did. And you can see that there is a failed one. The second one that I selected. So the error is for that. Look at the size difference. The processed video is almost one fifth of the original video size. So let's play it to see if you can make out anything by the naked eye. Hi dear friends, today in this video we are going to focus on a very important That was the original video Now let's play the compressed one Hi dear friends, today in this video we are going to focus on a very important feature of Microsoft Teams It is all about recording the meetings so the same recording I'm just expanding it to the full screen and you can still see that it is very clear it hasn't reduced the quality much 
but the size of the video has been reduced significantly. So before I wind up uh, the session, so let me open another video, which is you can see that it is like 197 MB, 192 MB, and it is recorded in full HD. So let's convert it or let us try to reduce the size of the file without reducing the resolution of the video. So let's convert or let's process encode this video from full HD to full HD but let's see the size reduction when we complete the encoding process. This is where you actually choose the presets. Under general option you don't have the 4K options available but if you go to the devices and Matroska I think it may be French they are looking at or they are referring it to the Mac indoors then you get the 4k option as well so without further delay let's use the default fast full HD option the process takes time you have to be patient I'm just fast forwarding it just finish the processing and then it took around like 15 16 minutes to finish the processing of about like 10 minutes video I think it's 15 minutes video and let's see the size of the video do you see the size it it is just above 14 MB instead of 195 MB most of the time we create videos for mobile or laptop or computers we don't create videos most of us as, at least for me i don't create videos for theater in that case you can definitely use and compress the size of the video before you can share with anybody else so record your video do a screen recording or a mobile recording camera recording no matter what you do use handbrake to reduce the size of the video and enjoy do not forget to subscribe the channel if you like the video i will be coming back with many more videos in the future and definitely we will see in another video hopefully very soon bye